How to sell membership on Squarespace. Hello guys, Celia here. In this video, I'm going to show you how can we easily sell our membership using this platform called Squarespace. So here we are on squarespace.com and in order to get started, we just simply need to click on get started in the right top corner. If you're new to this platform, you'll have to create an account. You can easily do it with your Gmail, but you can also create like separate account for this platform only. And we'll come to this page. Uh, Squarespace provides us the opportunity to create our website from different templates. We can easily customize them. But in order to sell memberships, we need to find the necessary type. So as you can see in the top of the screen right up here, we have a couple of types and also a couple of topics. So firstly, we need to choose membership. And as you can see, they provide us like a lot of different templates. Sometimes they could be repeated, but basically in order to uh, find the necessary template, I think it's enough. For example, if you want to create like yoga membership or something like this, um, all you need to know is that um, you can always customize um, any template to any template you want. You can change all the text, images and so on. In my case, I'm going to show you on this example right up here. As you can see, this website is totally responsive for different devices as any template on this platform. So let's click on start with this design in the right top and we'll start creating our membership product, something like this. And in a few seconds, we'll come to our workspace where we need to add a site title. Let it be like sub sub um, for course. Next, next and get started. So here we are and all you need to know is that um, this page contains two different parts. In the left side, we can easily interact with structure, marketing stuff, CEO, selling. And in the right side, there is the option to customize the wall website. So firstly, I'm going to show you how can we add so-called like subscription or membership product. And in order to do it, we need to open our selling area. And here we need to open our products. So as you can see on the selling area, we also have like a checklist, like we need to add products, add a way to get paid, choose a subscription plan, and then go live and start selling. So of course we need to add a product first. We can click on this button here or go to like subfolder on products and here click on add product in the right top corner right up here. And in order to create membership, we need to select the third uh, like option member site, create a members only area of your site with unique pages and exclusive content. So we need to click on it, click on create a member website. And after that, we need to add a name, let it be like paid pages. Also, we need to find uh, like what pricing plan will we continue like fixed amount, for example, set a one time purchase or payment plan, we can choose it right up here, we can choose like uh, one payment up to 12 payments and then just add a price, we can add a subscription, for example, let it be like $10 subscription, uh, repeat every one month. And also we can add some additional subscription options if it's necessary as for us. And the other like uh, way uh, that we can allow access to pages and content for free, maybe make so called like trial period or something like this. Let's click on done. And after that, uh, here we are, we like already created our area with paid content. So in order to find it in the left side, we have the option to like find all the structure and as you can see we have paid pages uh, they like pay world and in order to add it we need to something inside we need to click on this button right up here and then click on add a page and as you can see there are a lot of options of pages we can add uh, like different pages collections like course videos events portfolio store blog and so on. Sometimes it could be really helpful if you want to add uh, some videos, for example, or maybe some events or maybe some photos with a gallery and so on. We can click on add videos um, and choose the necessary type, for example, like this or like this. Yeah. And now uh, we have this uh, page right up here so we can easily open it. And here we can find all the options in order to edit content. We just simply need to click on edit. 
and we'll come to our editor where we can interact with every single stuff. As you can see, we have this uh, window here, which says manage videos and we need to click on manage. And after that, uh, we'll come to this page where we can interact with all videos right up here. So we can click on every single video. It's so-called like block. Uh, this video contains like information and also video itself. We need to open it and then just simply change this video. So we can uh, delete, edit, send to top, send to bottom. And in order to add a new one, we need to click on plus. Um, basically add a title, add video, add custom featured image and also like um, add some other stuff, description, expert, and so on. So all the steps are quite simple and I would like to show you how can we customize our website for a little, because now you know how to add a product. So basically we need to open previous page, go to this page like home here, and now we need to click on this brush icon in the right top where we can easily manage fonts uh, group. We can switch it to this one. I like this font group. Also, I want to change color palette. So let's go to colors, edit palette. And here we can find something suitable as for us. Sometimes it won't look really good, but we can try. I think this one is pretty cool. And also I would like to add animation as for my website like this. So yeah, now our website is ready to be posted. Of course, you need to like, you know, uh, edit content, add some description, but it depends on your goals. It depends on your aims. What would you like to add to your website? I'm just simply going to click on save and now I would like to click on exit. So uh, now we need to find the most suitable plan as for us because uh, of course we can add pay methods through Stripe, PayPal or Square. It also depends on your own. I think it will be more suitable as for you to use Stripe. It's pretty easy. We can connect Stripe to let customers pay with all major credit cards, Apple Pay and Afterpay or Clearpay. So now let's decide what paid plan of Squarespace is most suitable as for us. And I think that the most suitable for us is business or commerce basic. So the prices are different, like $33 or $36. And we need to find all the differences so you can open it by yourself and find all the differences between these two plans. Because personal is not suitable for any commerce business as a subscription plan. It's not available on personal plan of Squarespace. So as you can see, we have the differences in transaction fees for product sales. And also we have some additional options for basic commerce, such as point of sale, check out on your domain, powerful e-commerce analytics, which is really like interesting. So yeah, this is a way of how to sell subscriptions on Squarespace. Hope this video helped you out. Like, subscribe. Goodbye.